both in the Levi, because they have the shell of the contents, they have the minus one uh, for Charlotte XC, and the shell of the contents of the We are here right now with uh, Jay and Lindsay, and then we're going to have the person that the post that we can have that here. So we can kind of have the question. Uh, just as a reminder, we have the uh, translation service in Italy, and Spanish and English, so we can do the translation as well. Uh, if you join us, yeah. Um, I think this sermon um, kind of brings us together and kind of just I don't want to say compare, but kind of just um, you know shows how we kind of compete, you know, with you know MLS teams compared to the Um it just kind of is that the competition in there to see. You know how we do against those kind of opponents, and uh, obviously, with my experience, um, I played a million times, um, you know, against um, you know, in Mexico or uh, Latin American countries, um, and played in uh, obviously the top match as well. So, um, I've seen how, how those kind of games go about, and you know, hopefully, I can kind of bring you know, that kind of experience you know, to us as well. So, in a game like this, I know that. Dallas game, maybe you've probably felt like a regular MLS game, but when you add a knockout out of the Mexico, does this maybe hit a little different than what a regular season game would feel like? Yeah, I think all these games, no matter if it's, you know, obviously, Ellis Carter or the MX, I mean, we just know that, like, these games are literally winner goal type thing. And I think that puts a lot more pressure on the games to, you know, pull out a result. Um, and yeah, obviously, regular season, you have got that leverage to be like, oh, I know if you lose your tie game, you go on the next one and wait and see how you do the next game after that. Um, this game, it's literally, you got one game to show what you got, and if not, then you're one off. So uh, it just adds that kind of added pressure, which is, you know, for me personally, I love because it just adds pressure to our team and, you know, you have to step up and uh, make a lot of stuff on the team. How do you approach different? Is there like different aggression, labor savings, or how, how does that? Yeah, I mean, I think, like I said, it was much the same before, like, it's like that winner go home mentality, and so I think the biggest thing is just that mentality, you know, mindset, you know, whether it's in, you know, the 10th minute or the 90th minute, uh, or the shootouts, like, you know, we have to be, you know, that prepared, and we have to, you know, go out there and get a result. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, it's very important. I mean, because obviously, this least comes to gives us a chance to, um, you know, gain some confidence. Obviously, with the you know, with the shootout, um, you kind of see it this week, and it seems kind of morale and kind of brought us up a little bit. So, uh, we're gonna go out there and you know, hopefully, we play tomorrow, and you know, hopefully. Depending on how far we go through at least go, uh, you know, we kind of still keep that same kind of mindset and morale going into MLS season again. Um, because it's important. We still have, you know, 12 games of MLS left to go and uh, you know, we want to finish those games on, on a good note. Have you seen Yeah, I think but like I said, I would say this competition is like for me, like it's like how we to go home, like you know, obviously, if we lose, then it puts us in, you know, real jeopardy. But if we win, you know, we keep going. Uh, we want to keep building that confidence. And, um, you know, like I said before, I think, you know, kind of taking the spirit from MLS, obviously, we've been winless the last couple of matches. And, um, you know, obviously, it's great. You know, kind of came at a good time. And, you know, hopefully that, you know, we get this League Cup, League Cup experience and kind of bring what we learned from League Cup, that kind of the mentality of, like, that winner go home, kind of use that for each and every game in MLS. You know, I think we'll we'll, we'll be up in that kind of spot this year. Uh, I mean, honestly, we we got a you know privilege the chance to watch them you know against Dallas uh, during the week. So, um, you know, we've kind of seen you know their typical ways of playing and stuff like that, their tactics. So, uh, we've been doing a lot of work for practice this week, and you know, hopefully, we kind of go out and do results. Um, like in terms of like how straightforward the fundamental goal was 
Um, obviously coming back to playing at home, that'll, that'll be a big key. Do you feel like also when you get closer, if the, if the game is close, do you feel like getting to a shootout, you know, maybe get, getting that point to advance? Do you feel like you have that, obviously you want to try and win, but do you feel like knowing maybe a point would be enough just getting to the shootout that you might play, you'll still be aggressive to try and win, but playing for the shootout at, say if there's five or 10 minutes left and you're tied, do you feel like you go into that mentality just so you can protect that point? Yeah, about the mentality, I'm uh, pretty sure that we're going to try to win the game in that is that we can go into the game to stay out of the mentality. Um, okay. Uh, I mean, obviously, uh, every game, uh, you know, at least we want to go in and try to win the game, um, and especially that's obviously a goal that was as well. Um, you know, obviously, we, at the same time, we want to play in our style, we want to play the way we want to play, we want to play good, um, we want to win the game, especially. Uh, but obviously, if we do get the shootout, um, that gives us that, that extra chance to, you know, lead them ahead and obviously push past uh, our opponent and uh, the PKs, but our main goal is to go out there and win the game that means. Thank you. 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 Thank you.